the Lord spoke to our heads. Ask the Lord your God for a sign, whether in the deepest depths or in the highest heights. But our heads said, I will not ask. I will not put the Lord to the test. Then Isaiah said, Hear now, you house of David. Is it not enough to try the patience of humans? Will you try the patience of my God also? Therefore the Lord himself will give you a sign. The virgin will conceive and give birth to a son and will call him Emmanuel. He will be eating curds and honey when he knows enough to reject the wrong and choose the right. The barn. I am tired of this barn, said the colt, and every day it snows. Outside there's no grass any more, and icicles grow on my nose. I am tired of hearing the cows breathing and talking together. I am sick of these clucking hens. I hate stables and winter weather. Hush, little colt, said the mare, and a story I will tell of a barn like this one of ours and the wonders that there befell. It was weather much like this, and the beast stood as we stand now, in the warm, good dark of the barn, a horse and an ass and a cow. And sheep, asked a colt, yes, sheep. And a pig, and a goat, and a hen, all of the beasts of the barnyard, the usual servants of men. And into their midst came a lady, and she was cold as death. The animals leaned above her, and made her warm with their breath. There was her baby born, and laid to sleep in the hay while music flooded the rafters, and the barn was as light as day. And angels and kings and shepherds came to worship the babe from afar. But we looked at him first of all creatures, by the bright, strange light of a star. Lord Jesus, thank you that you love me, not in some aloof, impersonal way, but with the cherishing love a good father delights to give his firstborn. Thank you that your love for me now is as long-suffering love. Faithful, devoted, unchanging, inextinguishable. And thank you that on that glorious day when I see you face to face, 
I shall experience that love in rich measure. I shall live eclipsed by that love for all eternity. Amen. As our Saviour taught us, so we pray. And our Father in heaven, hallowed be your name. Your kingdom come, your will be done, on earth as in heaven. Give us today our daily bread. Forgive us our sins, as we forgive those who sin against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For the kingdom, the power, and the glory are yours, now and forever. Amen.